Hey everybody, it's Kalani and Gary Hello. again. We're coming to you today from our home. Mm -hmm. And a couple things you, you might notice, if you hear any snoring in the background of this video, it's Annabelle, she's in her bed. She's um, sleeping quite She's sadly. sleeping, Annabelle's one of our dogs. The other thing you might notice is there's an old radio over here behind us. This was my grandfather's radio. And actually um, it was on the cover of my first album, yep. Bending to Hear. But that radio is very special to me. And every time I look at it, I, I think about the old songs that were played on that radio back in, back in the days when it still worked. Yeah. But uh, I was thinking about some scriptures today. You know, a lot of us are familiar with Psalm 103 where it says, bless the Lord. Oh, my soul, bless the Lord and forget not all his benefits. Uh, another, there's another place in the Psalms, in uh, Psalm 143, it's verse 5, where David says, I remember the days of old. I meditate on all that you have done. I ponder the work of your hands. Yeah. In the Old Testament, at numerous really important times, God encountered someone in the Old Testament and they felt led to erect a, um, a memory stone, right. a stone of remembrance. Right. And mm -hmm. in our lives, there are moments, sometimes it can be a song. For me, uh, it's my journal. Over the last few weeks, the Lord has really been reminding me, go back and look at those journals. So I've been picking up my old journals and for probably seven or eight years, mm -hmm. reading through those journals and remembering and almost reliving that, that moment where right. God was faithful over and over again. And uh, as prophetic people, sometimes we're always looking for the new, but God's word for today can be something that he spoke into our lives yep. or sang through our lives in the past. Exactly. You're right. You know, at, at Access, we, we really focus a lot on prophetic song and how to release the song of the yep. Lord, the new song. But you're right. Like even, even an old song can have a prophetic anointing That's on right. it when it's released in the right season. Yeah. I was just telling Gary, you remember like Don Potter, yeah. some of the songs that he wrote even in the early 90s, right now are like, they feel so prophetic. They're almost yeah. more potent now than they were when he released them. Yeah. So for me as a songwriter, definitely one of the ways that I, I have those stones of remembrance, mm -hmm. those memorials with the Lord are the songs that I've written over the years. They're, uh, they're a way that I'm chronicling my journey yeah. with the Lord. They mark my history, the history that I'm building with God. And so uh, if you follow me on social media, you may have seen some of my recent videos where I'm actually going back and singing the old songs that I wrote, you know, 10, 15 yeah. years ago. And it's doing something in my heart. You know, the Lord said, I want, I want you to sing my, your old songs to me. And I was like, okay, yeah. you know, so, so if you, if you, if you keep a journal, going back and reading, you know, reading what the Lord, like remembering what God has done. I mean, come on, He's yeah. He's so good. Uh, for me, as, as a songwriter, it's songs. Maybe it's just um, your testimony. You know, remembering a time when He uh, He answered your prayers, He He uh, healed your body, whatever that may be. Um, take that testimony, share it with your kids if you never have, or right. with your spouse, with your friends, and. Um, and let the, your testimony be that, that memorial stone in this season. Over time, our perception of who God is can kind of shrink. And as we begin to remember his goodness, like David did, go yeah. back and remember, all of a sudden our perspective gets wide again. So I just, I'd like to take a minute and just pray for you. Lord, would you remind us of what those memory stones are in our life? Mm -hmm. Be it a song that we played, a song that we wrote, a song that we heard or lived out, our journals, Lord, are some testimony that you've given us, Lord. Remind us of those things and allow us to begin to exercise and to relive your goodness again from days past so that we can be filled in the present and have your vision for the future. In Jesus' name. Amen. Mm -hmm. Awesome. God bless you guys. Have a great day.